Mr. Vice President, Mr. Secretary of State, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends. Four times I visited the President of the United States in the interests of peace since we were elected by our peoples to conduct their affairs, to care for the future, and for the preservation of liberty and democracy in our countries and elsewhere. Twice I met the President of Egypt in a spirit of understanding, in goodwill, and common striving for peace in Jerusalem and in Ismailia. However, there is no doubt that this fifth meeting with President Carter and third with President Sadat is the most important, the most momentous of them all. My friends and colleagues, the Foreign Minister, the Defense Minister and I, and our friends and advisors will make all endeavors possible to reach an agreement so that the peace process can continue and ultimately be crowned with peace treaties. This is the peace mission on behalf of which we come now to you, Mr. Vice President, to the United States, and to our dear friend, the President of the United States. We are grateful to the President for the hospitality he bestowed upon us in his retreat at Camp David. And let us all hope that out of that unique political conclave, a day will come when the nations of the world will say, Habemus Patsem, we have peace. Thank you.